So the first question is correct. Like I said, I got negative times negative is positive and negative times positive is negative. So this one is correct. 7 times 4 is 28 and 7 times 3 is 21. That's also correct. And you were able to say minus x plus 21x that gives you 20x and 8 plus 28 is 36. But this second one, I want to try and see how correct it is. Minus 4n into minus 2n minus 3. Then, so, close the bracket, minus 2n into 1 plus 2n. So step by step approach, we have minus times minus is plus, so 4 times 2 is 8, n times n is n squared. Please take note of this, okay? okay? Yeah. Then minus times minus also is positive, so 4 times 3 is 12, then I have n. And minus times positive is negative, 2 times 1 is 2, then I have n. And minus times plus is also negative, 2 times 2 is 4, then I have n squared. So I have some of them n squared, some of them n. I mean, two of them are n squared, while two are n. So those are the like terms. So if we bring the like terms together, this will be 8n squared minus 4n squared, then plus 12n minus 2n. Then, since I'll be subtracting this, it's going to give me 4. 8 minus uh, 4 is 4 n squared. Then, since I'll be subtracting this, it's going to give me 10. 12 minus 2 is plus 10, then n. So this is the answer, unless I just want to factorize it further, but normally this is the answer. So number three, yeah. number three, um, I have five into another five x plus seven then plus 3 into x plus 3. All of them are positive, so our answers will be positive. 5 times 5 is 25, then I have x. 5 times 7 is 35. 3 times x is 3x, and 3 times 3 is 9. So I have 25x plus 3x plus 28x. Then I have 35 plus 9. That should be 44. So maybe you lost your way somewhere there. But please, do you understand this method now? Yeah. OK. The next one, number four. We have 3 into n minus 2 minus 8 into 5n minus 2. So 3 times n is 3n, and 3 times negative 2 is negative 6. Negative 8 times 5 is negative 4. So, can you hear me? Yes. OK. So negative 8 times 5 is negative 40, but it's n there. So negative 8 times negative 2 is positive 16. So some with n, some without n. I have 3n minus 40n. Then I have negative 6 plus 16. So 3 minus 40 is negative 37n. And minus 6 plus 16 is positive 10. So this is the solution to that number 4. Then question five, 
we have 2x into 3x minus 3 plus 7 into 1 plus 6x. So this, let's look, do, do this together. 2 times 3 is 6, and x times x is x squared. Then 2 times negative 3 is negative 6, but there is a hex there. And this other one is 7 times 1, which is 7, and 7 times 6 is 42, then x. So we can see two of them have x, while the rest have nothing in common. So we can say um, 6x squared minus 6x plus 42x plus 7. So 6x squared minus 6 plus 42. That means I should take away 6 from 42. Then I'm going to have 36. So that is plus 36x plus 7. This becomes our answer. Okay. All right. Um, let's see the next question, number six. Number, okay, let me copy from this number six down to the other page so that we can be able to fix it right there. So this is still a simple equation, oh, not equation, simple algebraic expression. So simplifying algebraic expressions. So number six says negative into 8n minus 5 plus 3n into n minus 7. Please concentrate. Do not stop yeah, out uh, because I can see your hand moving and you know if you are coordinating your hand and coordinating your mind onto the explanation there might be distraction. So negative times 8n is negative 8n and negative times negative 5 is positive 5. Then 3n times n is 3 of n squared. Then 3n times 7 is going to be negative because there's negative there, 21n. So we have some n and 1n squared or something. So 3n squared minus 8n minus 21n plus 5. So we can't do anything to the 3n squared. So we write 3n squared. But negative 8n and negative 21n will give us negative 29n, then plus 5. And this is our answer. Number 7. 6 into 6x plus 5 plus 8x into x minus 5. Let me write that again. So with this, I have 6 times 6 is 36, but there's x there. And 6 times 5 is 30. And 8x times x is 8x squared. Then 8x times negative 5 is minus 40x. So again, some have x, while 1 is x squared. So 8x squared plus 36x minus 40x plus 30. So we have 8x squared. Now 36 minus 40 is negative 4x. Okay? okay. Then plus 10. So this is going to be the answer to that. Then the next one, number 8. For number 8, we have negative 2 into 7n plus 3, plus 7 into n plus 1. So negative 2 times positive give me negative 14 n. The negative times 3 is negative 6. Then this is 7 times n is 7 n, and 7 times 1 is 7. 
So we have negative 14n combined with positive 7n, then negative 6 combined with positive 7. So if you take 7 negatives to cancel 7 positives of n, we have 7 negatives of n left. Then if you take 6 positive to cancel 6 negative, we have only 1 positive left. And number 9. We have 7x into negative 8x plus 1. Plus 4 into minus 2x minus 3. So we're going to open our bracket. You are busy playing, I mean, tapping something on your screen, which is a sort of distraction, you know. 7 times 8 is 56, but there's a negative there. So negative 56, then x squared, because of x times x. And 7 times 1 is this is 7, then you put the x. Minus 4 times negative, I mean, positive 4 times negative 2 equals negative 8, then x. Then positive 4 times negative 3 is negative 12. So we have negative 56 x squared. Then 7x minus 8x is negative 1x, then minus 12. So that is. And the final but not the least, the final question there, number 10, negative 3 into x plus a plus 2x into negative 4x plus 3. So we have negative 3 times x is negative 3x, and negative 3 times positive a is negative 24. So 2x plus 2x times negative 4x squared, that will be negative 8x squared. I mean, so positive 2x times 3 is positive 6x. Then this is going to give us uh, x squared there. So 8x squared. Then minus 3x minus 6x or 6x minus 3x then minus 24. So finally, we have negative 8x squared. Then 6 minus 3 is 3x and minus 24. This is our answer. Um, I believe you've seen maybe where you, you made some mistakes there, right? Right? Yeah, okay. 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 So I want you to put down the correction before I give something to try for today. Um.